This whole vise was my grandfather's, and it's got really coarse jaws in it. And I made these little aluminum inserts a long time ago, but they fall out every time I try to use them. So, today I just got through making some heavy aluminum jaws to fit in here and cover them. And I think these are going to work a lot better for me. Alright, let me show you how I did it. This is the pattern uh, for the vice jaws that we're making. And it's just 3D printed. And I'm going to, uh, it's got draft, 1% uh, draft, yeah, on all these different sides. So it should pull. We'll just have to wait and see. So let's get it rammed up and see how we do. I'll have to make two of these. Another vice jaw right there. Lost a little sand right there in that corner, so I'm gonna have to got a little aluminum I'll have to get out of there. But other than that, that looks really good. Alright, I've got one of our vice jaws loaded in here, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna flatten off this side so that then I'll have a flat edge in order to register to get this. That's the face. Alright, so we got that knocked off, so next what I want to do is I'm going to put this block in here because what I need to do is get this front edge parallel to this edge. So I'm going to set it on that. Let's see, I need to actually do it like this. I'm going to set it on that edge and then square it. Alright, so I just want to make sure that we're level in there. Let me get another one of these blocks. All right, so this is the one that I didn't machine the top, and I'm gonna clamp it in here for just a second. And uh, knock some of these burrs off.
Now they are two different heights. So we'll just have to see how annoying that is. But I think that's going to work pretty good. So let's try clamping something up. Yeah, I think that's going to work pretty good. Alright, well I hope this was useful to you. Thank you for watching.